Hey guys, this is one about the booty booty video. Good start. This might be one of the only times I record an offline video, but oh my god, dude, I'm not streaming today and I was just trying to do some easy demons like while I'm waiting. And I find this level, okay? I thought this was just gonna be another easy demon with coins. I don't, I don't it's not on the coin list right now, and I don't know if it's going to be, but like my god, I've already I've already found two of the coins and it was quite the journey. I'm still working on finding how to get the second one, but here let me just let me just go through. So the first coin is right here, and you might be like, wow, that looks really not hard, Zeronium. Until you realize you are stupid, and there's actually a saw blade. Um, I could play through the rest of the level, but basically there's two more coins that look like you could get them pretty easily but also you have no idea how to get them so like I'll, I'll give you a little insight as a coin grinder what it's like here's the second one boom it's just right under there it's like oh how hard could that be you probably just need to find a teleport portal to get under there right it's gonna be so easy i still haven't figured that one out by the way here's the third one my first thing when i do this is i open the editor and um first thing you notice is that this is actually a touch touch triggered rotate and you might be able to immediately notice that there's a very very small toggle orb here this level has a bunch of really small things like that so what this does is actually it brings up that toggle and then you enter this spike corridor and it gets a lot more complicated because there's a bunch of other small things okay but so the, the thing that makes this really stupid is that you can actually move triggers in the editor which is a great feature and all but it makes it so people can like hide their shit in the editor pretty fucking well oh yeah there's also this i really don't know if this <laughs> There's this thing. There's like an alternate path up here. And I don't know if it's actually possible to get here. Is it even possible to get here from zero? Is this- this is the torsion wave, but like super buffed. Or like, it's faster or something. That's so weird. I'll just go through again. Let me just show you the first coin. The one I know how to do. So, you have to hit the toggle, of course, at the beginning. <sighs> We're gonna be here for a while. Eh? Then you have to- you have to do like the- You have to switch gravity right before hitting the pad. That way you can hit the toggle orb that's there. And then you enter the- the corridor. Which is like, really hard. You, it's just the first click you have to time really well, because you just spam. And then you have to do it again, right there, in which you go in here, a random teleport that takes you to three slow mini double spikes. And of course, these are fucking hard. And then you get teleported here, and you just click and jump, just like that. Third corner is super easy to figure out as well, so I just go through that real quick. You just jump. You jump in this transition, and then you turn to a ship. The only other hard part is... Um, this is a block you have to clip through because these saw blades are on top. So you have to do it like that. And then you just keep flying through. It's honestly not too hard. So yeah, there's... There's something. I really want to figure out how to get the second coin. I gotta search if this anyone's found this shit yet. It seems like... I, I looked in the freaking Star Grinders server and it seems like people are already freaking talking about this level. In the coin grinding area, but no real answer. I'll have to voicemail. Hello, please help me. I don't really know. The, this part could be like touch triggered for all I know. Maybe there's a click limit. I guess I, got, I guess it's my job to find out if that's true or not, right? There's a lot of triggers here though, and I don't see anything. I don't understand. What do you- <sighs> This may in fact be the worst day of my life if I don't figure out how to get this coin. Fuck it. While I'm waiting for the person, I'm just gonna try to do the first coin. Oh my lord. Um, and hopefully not die. Oh, okay, that's step one. There's a few more things to do. And I gotta do those jumps, bro. Dang it, bro, again. Darn, dang it. Darn, dang it, diddly. Okay, well, this is kind of, yeah, I like to get coins, okay? And I encourage people to try to get coins. Like, you don't have to do a coin if it's way out of your skill set or skill range. Like, you're playing easy demons and you might come across a level like this. Like, you don't have to get the guiding coin if it's this hard, but... God damn it. Um, yeah, I encourage, I encourage coin collection. It honestly just makes you, like, I don't know what to say. I think it just, it is like a complete experience of the level. If it has coins, then you get 100% on the level when you get the coins, right? You don't just, you don't just beat it, you complete the level. And, oh my lord, I've died of this triple, the third one, like, five times. That's more, th and more. Yeah, like, I think it's just, like, if you're gonna play this game for fun, like, if you're gonna play this game for stats and you don't care about coins, then whatever. I guess a lot of people play for stats, but I play for fun. And I think a cool thing is playing levels mostly how, like, they're supposed to be played, and that includes coins for me and my brain. It's honestly just fun challenge, like, it makes it a little bit more interesting, especially when you are maybe, like, I'm a bit of a demon grinder. It makes it a bit more interesting to have levels that have coins in them. Like, that's, it's always a fun little 
extra challenge, you know? So yeah, if there's anything I can I can try to convince my viewers to do, it's try some coins. Try to get some coins in your levels, especially if they're demons, especially demons. Like if I can understand star grinding, you know, you can one attempt levels. If you're gonna already practice a level, you might as well just figure out how to get the coins too. You might as well. Most of them aren't hard. Some of them are warehouse, but you know, that's not all of them. Dude, it makes me feel like I'm being Truman showed or something, the way I died at that last one so much. No, 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 no. <laughs> I look prematurely no. There we go. Okay, now I have to beat the level. It's an easy demon, right? Yeah, okay, let's do it. Nice, okay. I got one coin, and next we're gonna do the second coin because while I was freaking trying to do this, someone actually showed me how to get the second coin and it does in fact involve the four times speed torsion wave above the level so I'm not exactly excited for this one because I think it might be even harder because I'll just show you through it there's a bunch of things that for some reason I couldn't just see in the editor I could have guessed that this was how to do it but like it never actually came up came like up when I was playing I'm gonna start by going in here and then you want to do that like I was thinking like what if I skip these red orbs and that's why I thought maybe that this part is touch triggered, you know? But you have to go like this, and then like that. And then you have to, um, I think you have to be upside down. Like that. Yeah, but now there's no spikes, because usually there's spikes on the top and bottom, so when you'd fall here, you'd hit a spike. But now, when I fall, I actually play torsion wave four times speed. It's also like nine circles. They like, they like change it to be nine circles affected, which is really fucking weird. So this is a hard coin, but this one's wave based. So maybe my fucking skills can come in a little bit here. And it says a good game and they are launched back in the level. Okay, simple enough. I mean, it's pretty simple. Like this is just hard, right? Okay, I did the wave once. Okay, it's not too hard because I'm the best. I gotta do the whole, um path, like alternate path thing in the ship and UFO. I know how to do it, I just need to make sure I can do it from zero, because I'm gonna, I don't want to spend too much time fucking dying. Like this first gap here, you need to go between the saw and the moving thing, is not the easiest thing ever, and it'll probably ruin my day from zero. Okay, here we go, wave attempt. No! I honestly thought I did it, because I passed the parts that are hardest for me. Mm, dang it, but I didn't click long enough on that one. <gasps> it's uh, it's like, it's always a little bit fun to do these hard coins, but if you get stuck, it's pretty miserable. I don't want to get stuck, I want to I wanna succeed, I want to get far. I can do it! <laughs> Fuck sake, dude. I fucked it up, bro. Oh, what? That worked? Okay, so I've, I, I think I've been making it a bit harder than I need to the whole time. Hold on, I've been going below this saw blade, but I just went above it and I lived. So maybe I'll just fucking, I don't know, man. Maybe I'll just do that again. Like, I, I'm actually still unsure what I'm doing, but I'm just doing it. I'm just trying my best out here, man. I don't know what I need to do and what I don't need to do. Maybe there's an even smaller trigger that I never found. Can't tell ya. <laughs> Why do I die there? Dude, stop it, stop it. Dude, this wave is just so hard mode. So difficult map. Makes me sad. Like, it would probably be easier if I could see more. See more, Skinner. But, um, I can't see that much. He has a funny name. Do you actually have that name? The hair in my mouth. Is that a real name? I wouldn't know. I only know The Simpsons. I don't really know The Simpsons. I just know Steamed Hams, because that was a hilarious meme. How long ago was that now? I feel like I was in middle school and that happened, but I'm not sure. Anyways, <laughs> I feel like if I do the wave one more time in practice, then I'm gonna beat it, like, immediately. So I'm going to do that. <laughs> it's really not that hard. Like, I could have done it by now. Is my, is my theme on this level just not good luck? There you go. Hold on. I'm looking good, baby. Here we go. Yes, 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 yes. Two coins collected. One more to go. The easiest one. Okay, whew, good. Now I'm just going to practice it because I don't need to practice anything else. Okay, well, I'm glad that's done. I told you, I, that was literally my first wave attempt after practicing too. I literally just needed a little bit more practice. You know, this flying isn't even that hard. Like, that's dead ass, like, really easy. <laughs> I know it's relative to the other coins and all, but, like, this coin could be, like, a coin in any level, to be honest. Not like a... Not like a hard coin level. You feel me? Anyways, I think I'm ready. Just try from zero. See how long it takes. Now, the struggle with this coin is actually I have to get there from zero every single attempt, which means good night. Get your pillows out. I'm already sleeping. Oh my god, I'm literally taking the other coin route because I'm stupid. 
Okay, my brother. Good first attempt. Better the straight play. Got 280 hertz. Jesus. That was too high on the black. Too high on the black. First time with the black. Dude, okay. I legit have forgot to click in the transition twice now. Three. In a, uh, two in a row is why I'm just too preoccupied thinking about how I'm gonna edit this video. Like, come on, bro. You've got priorities now and priorities later. You know, the editing part is for later. You're currently in the middle of the recording. So how about you focus on the goddamn game? No. No, I was close. Dude, I was clipping in that block like I was genius, but I went too low and ended up getting destroyed. Anyways, if you're watching this video, I hope I, hope I do release it. I don't really record things uh, off stream ever, um, but I uh, decided to spice up my day today. Hope you enjoy my videos. Thank you to, to, to everyone who have subscribed recently. You are helping me grow. Please get me to 17,000 now. Even though I just hit 16k, just do it now. There you go. I almost didn't get the coin. And just like that. It's just the clip, the block clip. That's all the that's all the difficulty of the third coin. But there you go. I have a completed warehouse with three coins. Um seven. I believe I'm actually second. Because no, probably not. Definitely not. Certainly not. This person is legit. I don't know. This person has lots of stats, it isn't bad. So potentially yes. Probably not. You know, who the heck is not Brandon too? Sorry, bro, but I don't know. It's always trying it's always a little bit fun trying to figure out how to do coins and sometimes it's fun actually getting the coins. That was that was not unenjoyable, but I've definitely had better experience experiences so 660 attempts yep that's it guys thank you for watching let me know if i should do more offline video probably they're probably similar to my other videos anyway just maybe a bit less goofy i feel like i'm a little bit better with a chat i'm a streamer at heart not a youtuber i can't sit here and talk to the cam i would say talk to the camera but i don't even use face cam so i'm talking to the goddamn jaw trash menu screen right now it's a bit awkward for me but maybe if i do more i'll get used to it i don't know man it doesn't matter can i just end the video thank you for watching like subscribe share to your mom and your dad and your friends and your besties i'll see you in the next video